Hey everyone, and for a quick little bonus guide this week, I decided to do a penguin hide and seek guide. So, penguin hide and seek is uh, pretty simple. Just there's penguins wandering around RuneScape. You go and you spy on them, and you get points. But I will go into more detail in this uh, throughout the video. First off, when you're doing Penguin Hide and Seek, make sure you're in World 60 and you use World 60 Pangs CC. Or Friends Chat, I forgot to change that. But it'll help uh, dramatically with your Penguin Finding experience. When you're actually going out to find the Penguins, just what I do is take 10 of every teleport I have out of my bank and all the free teleports, and then I just wear the lightest gear that I own. So anyways, let's get down to finding penguins. Or, if you have done the quest, you can find a polar bear in a well. Okay, so navigating through this chat could be a little bit tricky, but all you have to do is look out for uh, directions of penguins. And there are a ton of them, so just do not even worry. The first one that I saw when I was actually here, I saw a Musa crate at Northwest Horseshoe Gold Mine, and that's exactly where I went. Uh, the Northwest Horseshoe Gold Mine is a little C in the top northwest corner of Brimhaven. It's not actually Musa Point. You can see how drastically this penguin has moved, but I knew that the penguin would be probably right around there. All you have to do is just go to the spot that it says in the CC or that people say in the CC. Geez, friends chat, not CC. But all you have to do is go there and then just uh, find the penguin. And usually there will be a mass of people also there with you. So it's extremely easy. I'm doing this on a Thursday night and they reset on, I want to say Tuesday for where I am. But not complete, uh, not completely sure about that. But anyways, that's all you have to do. And there are 10 penguins like this and each one has a separate location so pretty much just go out and uh, have a good time playing hide and seek you guys also if you've done the quests you can actually get up to two points for every penguin that requires a quest to get to and you can also get an extra point by searching for a uh, polar bear and that'll give you a total of 16 points now to check your progress, all you have to do is type in penguin in quick chat and type or click the message that says I have found dot 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 penguins this week. And this will give you the number of penguins that you have found. Afterwards you can finish up by going to the R Oh, this this always trips me up. The Ardong Zoo, I think. That's how I that's how I pronounce it. Anyways, go there and then just uh, talk to either Chuck or Larry and you can claim your reward. In this case, I chose experience and I got almost 30,000 experience and that got me to level 66 rune crafting. So I know this was a very quick guide, but it's penguins and I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of a bonus extra this week. So anyways, thank you guys for watching and there are two guides on the screen. Feel free to click those. If you enjoyed this video, I think you might enjoy those too.